Welcome into this edition of Extra Time. Brian McBride, Alejandro Moreno, Stevie Nichol, Seb here with you. I know you guys are missing Dan Thomas, right? You've been missing him a lot this What's week. <laughs> you know, the guy you... Hey! <laughs> that guy, you don't remember him, Steve? <laughs> oh, no, he's not oh, oh, boy. Yeah. Oh, my boy. vacations yeah. don't look like yeah, that. Right. I, I, you know what? I thought my shoes needed clean. No wonder what it was. <laughs> is that is that a ponytail on the dog? Is that What is that? Is that some sort of... It's it's like the man bun, the mun. Uh, the hairy legs, let me tell you. Yeah, is, that, is that a velour suit? <laughs> is that on? Little, is that? I gotta give it to him. <laughs> We're sure that's not photoshopped, right? <laughs> Sunglasses on the head. Oh, Let's move on to the, uh, man. the matters at hand, shall we? Steve wants to know. Question for Ale. Who, me? No, Steve, the oh, guy sorry. on Twitter. Oh. Yeah. I thought you meant. But you may want to know the answer to this question as well. Right. Do you think Valverde should be playing Usmane Dembele more? As a Barcelona fan, it frustrates me that Dembele is not featured every game lately. It becomes even more frustrating when, when Barcelona is not getting results and you're not quite getting a whole lot of performance from Coutinho. It, it, it's frustrating for a lot of Barcelona fans as to what's going on with Luis Suarez as well. He's not scoring with the sort of uh, uh, frequency that you expect from, from them. I, I just look at Barcelona, and while we can focus on what's going on up top, their issues are in the back. So whether it, it may be frustrating not to see them belly out there, if I were a Barcelona fan, I would be more concerned as to what's going with Piqué, with Umtiti, the back line, the whole defending 1v1 situation, tracking back from midfield is just not quite there yet. A lot of what's going on over there affects as to what's going on in the front line as well. Next question comes from our good friend Damon. These questions always seem to work their way in when I'm hosting Extra Time. Uh -huh. <laughs> Does Wayne Rooney well, deserve MVP if he heroically oh. leads D.C. United to the playoffs. Uh, playoffs? Playoffs? Uh, um, Brian, you want to take this one? <laughs> uh, as much as he is the, the main reason why they get to the playoffs, people don't look at it, uh, at least I don't measure an MVP by getting a team to just the playoffs. Now, certainly he deserves all the credit for having a great season since coming there, um, and I think they'll They'll only get better as, as long as he's there. But yeah, for me, an MVP, it's got to be over the whole of the season, and the team has to be nearer at the top of their division. You agree? <laughs> Wait a minute. Actually, more importantly, do you, you agree? agree? <laughs> <laughs> uh, if they get to the final, let's say that they don't want it. Let's say they get to the final. Oh, my gosh. You give them the MVP. Well, you, but you don't wait till then to vote, you know? I, I think you could make a uh, you could make a case. Hold on, are you making a case? You could definitely make a case. Uh huh. What? Think it to the front. No, 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 no. And I have continue to... that idea. Come on. You can make a case for what? Spit it out. You could make. You could certainly make the case for Wayne Rooney as MVP. Hey! That's, that's <laughs> close enough. That's close enough, right? You could also make the case for Judge? Joe Acosta as MVP. That's close enough. Ladies and gentlemen no, of the jury. No, no. You That's it. The, case. the defense. Yes, the defense rests. Case. We're done here. The, the witness has exposed himself as <laughs> yes. a fraud. Yes. <laughs> We're done. Wow, he's <laughs> thrown himself in the witness. Uh, perjury. <laughs> Next question uh, for Steve. Oh, no, you were going to say, you were no, going to pile I, on I further, think, Brian. Yeah, I just think, I mean, what Martinez has done this season, breaking the record, mm -hmm. Atlanta at the top. I know he's got uh, Almiron, who's been exceptional also. I, I just think that it'd be tough not to say he's the MVP of, of this league. <laughs> I like Rooney's candidacy, but you know, Zlatan, you can make a case for him as well. Yeah, no, no, hey, right. hey, hey, hey. The, the defense already rested. The defense rested. Right. <laughs> this is inadmissible <laughs> now. Hey. Huh? <laughs> 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 I hate Rooney. I love Rooney. What's, what's, I hate what's Rooney. that sound? I love Rooney. It's Seth backpedaling out of the studio. <laughs> uh, Stevie, for you. Cranberry Juice wants to know, are defenders not given enough credit in today's game? <laughs> well, <laughs> you, okay. you, you get, what, what you get I've got to share. You got something in your I, eye? I actually think they do because there's not that many great defenders around. <laughs> when they do do well, we actually talk about it. And we were talking, we, we've been talking about it with Varane. Varane's in the list mm -hmm. for the Ballon d'Or. Uh, and if he won it, I, I wouldn't have a problem. He's been fantastic. So... I think the fact that we're talking about Varane being in the Ballon d'Or uh, awards 
uh, then says we do talk about defenders when they're good. I think that idea came from Julien Laurent. He's still with us. Jules, what do you think? Are, are defenders not given enough credit in the modern game? No, I agree. I agree with, with Stevie. I think we do focus a lot naturally about strikers, on strikers, on people scoring goals or creative, creative players. But I think there's still a lot of love out there for defenders. And like Stevie said, you know, we talked a lot during the World Cup about Varane and, and to a lesser degree maybe Umtiti and there's a lot of talk about Sergio Ramos and you know, people like that are recognised. I would, no, 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 I would no, love no, Varane no, to get no, the Ballon d'Or, like I said Jules, on the show. Jules, uh, Jules, you cross the line there, the you cross the line there. How can you mention Ramos in the same, same <laughs> breath when we're talking about defenders? Come on. No, 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 no. Come on. No, no, in the sense of him being good. I mean, in the sense oh, of, right. okay, of being, okay. him being talked about. You Acceptable. Know, like, yes. There's a lot to, you know, <laughs> carry <Yeah>. on, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the clarification, Jules. Uh, Thank we you, appreciate Jules. that. I think we've run out of questions here. That's it? No, That's there's it. one more. Oh, wow. There's one more, but I've been told oh, to... Oh, there's only like uh, four people saying questions there. Yeah. <laughs> no, I've been not. told to, to leave this one for another day. I don't wow. understand it anyway. You don't leave. understand that question? No. Leave which one? Well, you'll have, to, you'll have to find out about it tomorrow. Catch us seven days a week, right, ESPN+. Yeah. Plus. Okay.